you are wrong but thank you for saying it anyways because i have been wanting to say some things about it recently <laughs> As somebody whose birthday is March 29, 329, as somebody with three siblings, as somebody who loves things that are dynamic, I fucking hate even numbers. I hate even numbers. And eight is one of the worst even numbers. Odd numbers are great because they're they're odd, they're dynamic. If there was an argument happening, if like let's say if the number um, seven, let's say seven had dissociative identity disorder. And there was an argument happening within seven's system. Seven has seven. And so there is a tiebreaker. Seven can actually do things because seven doesn't just sit around arguing amongst itself all fucking day. Even numbers value balance and, and fairness and equality so much that they don't end up actually moving forward. They always stay where they are. And I'll say it, I'll say it, I'll die on this hill. Eight is one of the most egregious contenders of this category. Eight is a multi-leveled government of, of bureaucrats. Eight is, oh, I hate it. I hate eight so much. Eight has a superiority complex because it's so complex whilst also making sure that it ensures it gets nothing fucking done. Also, yes, I should just say, I recognize that having this strong of feelings about numbers is like, ooh, psychosis. I'm having fun. Relax, guys, okay? <laughs> But back to my TED talk, it thinks it has a great work ethic. And you know what? Maybe it does. Maybe, maybe the fact that it is, it is the sum of two fours. Ugh, how pretentious. Like I see you four. Just, you're just, you're two equal sets of two. All right. We get it. All right. You like things to be the same. You know what I see when I see four? I see four siblings bickering amongst themselves they can't come to a decision ever they can't decide what game to play and then five comes in mommy five you know what i mean break the tie all right you're gonna not do any of those things guys fuck you it's dinner time like five is like you know what i mean like she's hot you know i like five is ooh. all right all right i'll, I'll sit my ass down hey what's up six six is one of the only even numbers that i will give a pass and that is solely because internally I am about as mature as a five-year-old. And I think that the idea that when you have actual balance, so, you know, six being an even number, it prides itself on balance, but it recognizes that it's kind of spicy because the balance that it has within it is made up of two threes. Like, whoo, okay. She's, you know what I mean? She's got sexy lingerie on underneath her nun's outfit. If you want actual balance, you're going to balance the, the, balanced thing the even thing with something dynamic that would be actual balance and that's how we get 69 <laughs> nice i could go on forever and so I, I won't um yeah it's full moon or it, it's been it's been a couple of nights of a very big moon all the mentally ill people are acting up i'm making lots of new friends um but let me know if you guys like me roasting numbers you know roasting digits um because in true autistic fashion, I have much stronger feelings about this than I should, and I could do this for a while.